we're asked to find three integer solutions to the equation y equals negative three, and then graph the line. Each solution is an ordered pair in the form of x comma y that satisfies the equation y equals negative three. And let's organize the information in the provided table. In order for the equation to be true, notice how y must equal negative three. Let's record negative three for y three times. And now from here, since the equation does not contain x, x can be any real number. However, since we want integer solutions, we can use any integer for the x values. Let's just use zero, one, and two. And now we have three ordered pair solutions. One solution is zero comma negative three. A second solution is one comma negative three. A third solution is two comma negative three. Each of these ordered pair solutions represents a point on the graph of the line. Let's also record these ordered pairs as the points. And now let's plot the points on the coordinate plane. For zero comma negative three from the origin, we do not move left or right, we just go down three units. Here is zero comma negative three. For one comma negative three from the origin, we move right one down three. For two comma negative three from the origin, we move right two and down three. And now we sketch a line passing through the three points. And notice how the line is a horizontal line. For review, any equation in the form y equals c, where c is some constant, will be a horizontal line passing through c on the y or vertical axis. I hope you found this helpful.